I am real. Fancy that. Say, beautiful, let me in on the secret. What's going on here anyway? What are your hopes? What are your ambitions? What's your phone number? Who are you anyway? Who are you? Well, I'm a professional model, of course. Well, if you're only a model, I'd sure like to lamp the finished product. Hold the phone there. What's this? Wow, how many of you girls are there anyhow? Why, there are hundreds of girls making a successful living at modeling. Modeling? Hundreds like you, babe? That sounds like paradise. Gee, this modeling business looks like glamorous stuff to me. That's what they all say. But posing hour after hour in this Alaskan sealskin coat under hot lights isn't exactly what I call fun. Wrinkle that nose, honey. Tell me, where do you beautiful babes get your jobs anyway? How do these magazine people know where to find you? We're all registered at the model agency. If you will go down there and look through their files, you can find out all about us. Well, what are we waiting for? So long. Toodaloo. Hello. Do you mind if I give the place the once over? I'd like to get some first-hand dope on what makes the wheels go around in the model agency. Why, of course. I'd be delighted to show you around and explain it all. Hmm, just a little bit of heaven. I wouldn't mind working here myself. I'll bet every good-looking girl in town works here. No, but they hope to. Of course, we can't accept them all. We have over 100,000 applications a year. We try to interview each girl personally. Of course, magazine illustrators and photographers are always looking for beauty. But they are constantly calling for different types. One day they may need a... Pardon me, but are you listening? What's that? Oh, oh, oh yes, yes, sorry. I guess my mind was wandering. Seems to be a common habit here. I thought perhaps you might be interested in looking at some of these scrapbooks and seeing how the various girls are listed. As I said, photographers and illustrators are always looking for different types. One day they may need a blonde and then a brunette. Or perhaps their assignment calls for a short, dark girl or a tall, slender one. Many of the most successful girls aren't necessarily good looking but have special features of unusual form and beauty. A beautiful head of hair, perfectly formed hands or legs, correctly spaced eyes, and even white teeth are features for which many of these outstanding models are noted. Nice work if you can get it. Here's someone who can give you a lot of information. He's a photographer assigned to do the cover for the new issue of Friends magazine. Glad to know you. Yeah, you certainly look it. Howdy, Hypo. It must be interesting work, spending all your time taking pictures of pretty girls. By the way, does your camera ever get a cold shutter and feel a little negative? <laughs> Seriously, though, don't you ever get tired of it all? Doesn't picturing pulchritude ever, Paul? No, and my name's not Paul. Thanks, glad to know you. Say, I'm developing a personal interest in this work. Would you mind if I stuck around your attic a bit and watched you snap some pictures, Paul, pal, Paul, pill? Hey, I'm talking to you. Okay, come along. But don't get in my way. These are the ones I want. This one first. Who wouldn't? How can you smile so sweetly with such a sourpuss photographer around? Uh-oh, so this is what a photographer's studio looks like, eh? Hey, look, Sunshine, you, the fella, why don't you take your Kodak out to the curb and snap your picture in a real car? Why don't you try that? For this type of close-up, a real car would only be in the way of the camera. Oh, but I like close-ups. They're so cozy, don't you think? Or don't you? Hey, you, get out of the way. Who, me? You mean me? Yes, you. How can I see anything here with you in the way? Oh, so that's what you were doing under there, huh? Say, do you mind if I take a peek, chum? All right, make it snappy. Gee, it's upside down. How can I tell anything from this? Might try standing on your head. Okay, if you say so. Here goes. <coughs> there, that's okay. Well, well, whatever became of the old-fashioned running board, what'll they think of next? 
Look at that, will you? I mean the running board. Hey, you, what are you doing? Are you tired or does your work call for you being down there? This is what's called a worm's eye view. Take a look. Okay, worm, move over. Never mind, I'll take your word for it. Ah, swell. This shot is just to be a close-up of hands. Gee, that's graceful. Certainly looks easy. And it's certainly an easy way to make money. I'll tell you what you do. Bring that back light up a little bit on the rheostat. Never mind that spot, Joe. I won't need it. There, that'll do. That's okay. Boy, what a set of props. But why is it necessary to have anybody in the scene at all? Why don't you just shoot the car by itself? Hmm? Yeah. Or you. Ouch. But on the level, why not? Too static. Well, brother, those legs, uh, limbs, they, they sure add a kick to it. Ah, yes, it looks like the automobile is here to stay. Me too. Hey, Sonny, what's that stuff you're spraying on the car? Condensed milk. Condensed milk? I, I don't get it. What's the idea? Well, you see, this milk cuts down the light reflections. Hot spots, as we call them, that kick back into the camera. Oh, sure, I get it. Okay, Gus, that's enough. Take it away. All right, here we go now. Hold it. Come on, smile. That's fine. Hold it. Steady. Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Where's the moon? Hey, Sully! Okay, boss. Come on, make it snappy. Get in there and steady it. How's that? Okay. All right, here we go again now. Steady, hold it. Come on, Betty, come on, give me a smile. That's right, hold it, hold it. Okay. Wrap it up. I have a problem here. I can't make up my mind which one to use. Got any suggestions? Any one would do. They're all good. Uh, that's the trouble. Boy, oh boy, wouldn't you have a beauty if you could combine all those features that you've been shooting? What a nifty picture that would make. Say, that's a good idea. I'm glad I thought of that. You thought of it, say, that's my gal. Wanna buy a magazine, mister? Well, folks, here's where I came in.